Nice of you to drop in. Yo, 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 this is Julian from Blurting Out. I'm so excited to be bringing you guys another video. Um, I just want to start off by saying that that uh, you might be seeing a DualShock battery level low. That's, yeah. Yeah, apologize about that. My controller is real janky right now. Like, the only way I could use it if it's constantly plugged in and it doesn't charge. So I just want to apologize for that before I get into the actual video. But I want to be bringing you guys today... Uh, I want to say Tales of the Board, well, Tales from the Borderlands, a Telltale's game. I've never played this before, but I have played Telltale games in the past. I uh, just want to make sure. Want to make sure all music is off. Okay, that's good. Subs house on. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's good. Let's get it. Let's get it. So this should be episode one, I believe. Let's get it, guys. Oh, so they let us start off with episode one. Episode two. Episode three. Okay, you know what? Screw it. I'm, I'm just going to start from one. This is going to be the first video. for. This is just going to be the first video. Let's get it. Now, I will do my best to not talk. Uh, to not talk through any of the cutscenes. It adapts to the choices you make. This tale, the story is told about how you play. Interesting. I know Telltale games usually do that, but sometimes. To hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. He ran the corporation Hyperion and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less... Uh, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Cool, so that was pretty interesting intro. Um, yeah, I haven't played Borderlands since the first one, so this whole story is gonna, <laughs> gonna take some time getting used to. Now, where are we starting off at? Oh. Is this the main character? Fiona! Come on, we can work this out! Fiona? Is there some sort of radiation leak I don't know about? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but fam, you can't just be yelling out like that in the middle of nowhere. You can't be doing that. And now you just got popped. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, who are you? I ask the questions. Okay, then, do you mind asking yourself who you are? Hey, hey, man. How the hell? Tell me about the Gordis Project. Is that what this is about? Look, 
Gordis is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on Okay, 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 okay. okay. Don't be a smart ass. I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're getting dragged through the desert and uh from the beginning. Right. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> wow, okay, so we start out the story with basically the main character, or us, getting captured. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. And Handsome Jack, he was the baddest guy of them all. Long. It must feel good I to find to be rabbit, just you know? like him. Take it. It's yours, right? <laughs> I mean, you always said that. <laughs> Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but, uh, but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing with assholes. Man, when Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives. For the better. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be okay, cool. So, being an exec in Hyperion mm. comes with expectations. Screw it, let's go big. There are a couple sweet rides I've been looking at. More fitting of the position I'm gonna be in. Where the hell would you even drive that thing? We're in space. I wouldn't actually use it. It would be more for looks. Oh right. Well then, that's a great idea. We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep, sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. Nah, fam, we made it. We made it, okay? We're in this together. If I'm moving up, we're all moving up. You can be certain of that. I appreciate that, Reese. You know, people around here have short memories when it comes to that stuff. You, me, Yvette, we're gonna run this place. Yes, we are. All right, man, let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. Uh, blank stare? Oh, wow. No, oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's um, that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I am talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it in red. I want it in black. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why, okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. <laughs> Company car. Didn't even have to ask. Hey, bro, he sounds so damn familiar. You look surprised <laughs> to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So, you might not have been in the loop. No, but no, fam. No, it's fam. For the where's Henderson? Please for me. So, where's Henderson? He uh, stepped out. You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. Because <laughs> I thought this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? 
For the yes. exact same reason why North is North, why the handsome guy always gets the girl, and why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. It's destiny race. And men, real men, men like me, make their own. And you can hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul, your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. You don't want to be that man. Oh. Wow. I could not have timed that better. That really helps dramatically make my point. Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this vault key or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. Ten million. Yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Hey, hold on, man. Hold on. Is th that is Henderson. Bruh. What? What? The ear sucking up to the guy. Out the window. Yeah, 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 no, what? what? Man, man is floating in the middle of nowhere in space. Oh, damn. Oof. Do you want the money? Well, the scumbags always have the best view. It's not. I should be behind this desk, man. Me to get... oh, that should be me. Or less Vasquez. Yes. So let's not be sure. Okay, let's go. Yeah, that's what we had before. It's a working echo. Uh -huh. Okay, so press L1. This man got x ray vision in his eye? Bruh. What? Uh -huh. Look, oh, wow. Wrong. That's awesome. Wow. Okay. That's cool. That's really cool. What a waste. Why are you turning this into a whole Such thing? Such a nice right suit. Let me look at this. Not yet. Profit is rivaled only by its potential to kill you within minutes of setting foot on it. What? Look, I'll have to go. What? I... Oh wow. Okay, let me look at Vasquez. Uh. You go Vasquez. Thirty-five. Personal yeah, yeah. catchphrase is rock and roll, what? lock and load. It ain't no thing. Okay. Do you want well, the money or not? Screw him. I'm about to analyze this computer. It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get. Viewing one encrypted file. <laughs> what? Yes. Oh. Oh. I have no idea what that means, but it seems this? awesome. Oh, fine. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. <sighs> if it's going to be $10 million, I'm going to need another hour or two. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. 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 Okay. Say hi to your mom. Damn it. Uh, right. Now, uh, what were we talking about? You just got a whole we conversation, so huh? Rudely interrupted. Something about a vault key? We were talking. <clears throat> we were talking about my promotion. But I'm gonna be cordial on this one. All right. Your Where's my promotion? promotion? Anderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. 
He needed lesson number one. Humility. So you threw him out in Would space? Do. I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm going to make you assistant vice janitor. What? No. What? What? No. no. You, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report I should have just asked about the encrypted key. Effective immediately. You know what? Fuck you. I'll make you regret this, homie. Assistant, vice, and controller died. Okay. You know what? I'll hold my tongue for now. Oh! Your boss, Reese. Get used to that. Oh, now it's on. Now it's on. This is talking about when I say humility. That was lesson number two. Don't make lesson number three about a number two. What? Don't make me crap on the floor and make you clean it up. Assistant Vice Danner, my this. ass. It's okay. I'll, I'll get payback. I'll get payback. Man, what a dick. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us. He just did. No, 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 this can't be happening. I'm finished, Bob. I'm finished. You know this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, 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 they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. We just gotta keep it on the down low until we fix it. Fuck this trash can, dude. Senior Vice Janitor Reese to Sector. Sorry, you were saying something? I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought hey. you were getting a promotion. <laughs> trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Vasquez huh. screwed me out of the promotion. Yeah. Threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap. So, does that mean you're not buying? You bet fine. You bet fine. <laughs> Just try and like the move. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me. I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Baskets. I don't know if he's the type to. Can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? Nah, B. Nah. We steal his deal. We steal his deal. Yes! That is what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is, is vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Vasquez, we have a freaking vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. What? I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting, and it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. My man. Ooh. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right? Hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bar or two. You know, things get dicey. Look, it's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends. Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Richter was an asshole and his family are assholes. I'll buy you lunch if you help. Uh, and I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now and when you get back. Deal. <laughs> Done. We only got a couple hours. Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? I mean, you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... 
You're gonna steal something? I figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind. He is not about to use that company car. Yo. Yo. Oh my god, yo. This just got real interesting real quick. Is that the introduction? No way. No way. Yo. I'm definitely gonna have to keep playing this. This got real interesting. Oh my god. Ooh! 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 He got snot. Ooh, we. Damn. What is that headed to? Oh my god. <laughs> he did take the company car. <laughs> oh, it's lit. It's lit. Ah, right, yeah. This is gonna be a fun one. This is gonna be a fun one. I'm already having fun playing this. Tales from the Borderlands, huh? Not mad. Not mad. I'm getting a bad feeling about this place, but hey, I want to get back in Vasquez any way possible. Keep driving, keep driving. Don't, don't get out the car. Keep what driving. Even, what are we even Why? hit? Why? Why? I hope that wasn't Why like a really ugly person. Why would you cross right there? Oh, crap. I think we, I think we killed it. Do not get out the car. We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great. We murder. You know, I, I thought it would take longer than 20 seconds Screw that. that. It's only a skag. Keep moving. Relax, Keep moving. Vaughn. It's a skag. They breed like hostile rabbits down here. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. Kind of. Is that thing still moving? Alright guys, so I'm about to stop here for right now, but that's part one of this new series, um, Tales from the Borderland, part one. Please continue to check out the channel for more. Uh, follow me on Twitter at, at blurred underscore in underscore out for any updates about any videos or, you know, just daily life. Uh, and subscribe to the channel. So this is the first video. Um, I'm definitely going to be playing this more. I'm having a lot of fun. Uh, I will be bringing out some more videos now that I am done with school for the semester. I'm done. Glad to make it through. But, you know, but just say have a great day, guys. Remember to blur it out. I will be back with more videos.